that I was even inclined to call him the winner of this match, but since it was it was so early in the match, I, w I really didn't want to call it a winner I just now. So, same story as last time. Inquisitor versus k -Nob. The thing now is that Tex knows what Aldilla went for the last time, and he's not gonna make the same mistakes that he did before again. So Komarov's gonna immediately go for some center control, or since he knows that Adila is actually going for three units in the, in the beginning, he's gonna decap this power. So annoying! Is he gonna decap? No, maybe stun bomb. No, but he okay. He's just gonna harass. So, yeah, he's harassing the crap out of these guardsmen. He's already taken three models, but they just pop the sergeant and all is fine. But that did buy him the time to actually get some presence in the center of the map before Adila can put down a last turret. And, yeah, we have seen what the last turret actually did to the last game. Does the sentinel have the storm? Storm's coming up. Right now, he's taking a lot of damage here. A Holy Brazier not up yet. Stomp is coming in. He needs to save it. He needs to save it. It needs to be a good Stomp because these guards are also personally low. Let's see. Stomp might be coming in here. He's gonna... Yeah, he catches these Sluggers very, very well. And now these Sluggers in turn are in trouble. No, but the Inquisitor actually has to retreat because the second Slugger squad is still... Uh, So chasing the Inquisitors, and now we see burns on these sluggers. So it was actually a good, good move here from Adila to retreat these, uh, to retreat the Inquisitor, because she would have most definitely gone down to burners, or to burners sluggers. These guards are caught out here, though. He is kiting away. They get a special though, and that might be the end of the guardsmen. Do they have their sergeant? They have their sergeant. Needs to get a good retreat path here, and he needs to hit that retreat button. He doesn't, and they're gonna go down. That is a huge loss. That is a huge loss. Hammer of the Witches go, go, goes down on the commander knob. Ah, damn it. Wait, didn't Tex have double shooters? No, he didn't. It seems he was the victim of a bug. Yeah. We have seen that time and time again that units actually just just refuse to do what you tell them to do. Which is really, really annoying. Because losing uh, guardsmen like that they already had the sergeant as well it's it's quite painful and now Adila really is lacking some map presence while Tex has added looters to his army as well holy brazier again I feel sorry for Adila here because he could have made it to round 3 in this bracket, but now he has been fucked by Relic like two times. And that is so unfortunate. No, actually that's not true. It was Steam the first time, but then this retreat bug is incredibly annoying. It has been around for quite some time, but yeah, we all know that Relic dropped the support for this game, so we just have to, we'll just have to deal with it. Let's see, we're gonna see a handle of the witches here, maybe on the knob. He's low enough. Oh, the Inquisitor is gonna go down here though, maybe. This is taking huge amounts of damage on retreat. But we do have the stomp, okay. I didn't account for the stomp. Very nice. Just wanted to pour in some DPS. Tex needs to play this, uh, not Tex, but Adela needs to play this uh, very, very tight, but I feel he has already lost um, much map presence here, and 
now he has to he has to play it very very uh, defensively with a sentinel since he needs map presence so he can't always be babysitting the sentinel with a guardsman We shall see, triple cap, BPs are starting to tick down very, very fast, coming on the decap in this pretty much a wreck point. Going to see a stun bomb here. Uh, Garsman perfectly evaded, but now we see Sluggers, they're baiting out the storm. They did not, uh, but only half of the Sluggers are stunned. He replaces Guardsman and realizes that he he does need this second Guardsman squad. And Catachins. We're ready here, sir. Go ahead. Retaking the natural victory point. It's okay though. We all know that losing uh, models as IGs, it's not that big of a deal. Wow, this is a fully mature wreck point. This is gonna be a fully mature wreck point soon as well. Here as well. This one has just been retaken, or this one just matured sure, to plus 15. I don't know how um, good these IDs will be, since the shooters already have their mob leader, and the mob leader detects Texas Floji. He's floating quite a lot. Like, a lot. You could have already queued up a vehicle. Almost. Adila's even going to two before him. Well... <coughs> Never mind though, because here comes Lagos. Like Tex is just pushing it to the maximum, just attacking Adila on all fronts, army-wise. Uh, he's attacking Adila's... Economy Sluggers could have taken out these guys, but this would have been GG for sure. But where are these catechins now? These catechins are actually just standing by. They need they. Reporting enemy contact. It's a very good holy pyre here. But yeah, Sentinel is in a very good angle here to these shooter boys. Let's see, can the shooter boys shoot from there? No, but the looters actually can hit the Sentinel. He does have repair support, but here come some infiltrated sluggers. It's going to be a very uphill battle here for Adila. And sluggers get on the retreat path as well, so we're going to take a few models. Stomp is off cooldown though. It's been used on the Slugger. Slugger didn't actually take a lot of damage here. And this looks like there's gonna be a, a downed power farm. Sir, we're losing a victory point out there. Cadians reporting we've found a requisition point here. Who's just covering the retreat here. Turning around here to uh, shoot at the at the catechins, but yeah, now they're gonna be Double. Let's see, will this thing come in in time? Nope, it doesn't. I think he actually cancelled it. He was trying to put down an IED on retreat. Wow, Ooh, that hurt. And the catechins are dead. God damn you. And I think that is the end of Adila in this monthly Rumble tournament. Hmm. Although, 200 red. The requisition is there, the power is there. Are we gonna see Le Bain Wolf? Yes! <laughs> oh. Vicious. And Tex cannot do a thing to this Bane Wolf. And look at this, I don't know what the primary weapon is called, but this goo shooting stuff. Ah, it's painful. And it also debuffs since it slows, I believe. Yes. But we could see the Beamy Looter upgrade here. He's going for a double tank bus. He really wants to kill this Bane Wolf. We're gonna see a counter bash here. He's gonna try to get the victory point here. This Bane Wolf is his last hope. 
infiltrated tank busters. Ouch, 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 ouch. This will hurt. But the tank busters themselves will take like a lot of fire. There we see the opening salvo from the tank busters. Bainwolf almost down to half health. There we see the tank buster barrage. Beautifully hit. Not all of it, but still. Some damage. Bainwolf has to back off. And I think this is gonna be a repair bunker. Won't be long, sir. But now that there are double tank busters, this repair bunker is just gonna be done immediately. Yeah. And Both Tex is going tier request. three already, so a victory point is yeah, slipping at this away. point, there's nothing that I can do. My seal of office, and yet so much more. I protect the Imperium. Now we see excruciators. Grants the assailable. Oh, I think this yeah, Beowulf is dead. Because it. it has yeah, let's get to it. driven itself into a corner here. Oh yeah, the text can't actually see where the Bane Wolf is. And then we see the Assail also dealing damage over time and he combined it with the Holy Pyre as well. That's quite painful. Took half of the health here from the Tank Busters. Commando Nob is just decapping stuff. Just being very annoying. See a stun bomb here. Oh, and the Inquisitor actually specials the Commando Nob out of the stun range. And now double sluggers close in on the Inquisitor. The oh, I'm so... Oh, and this is a dead Bane Wolf, I'm guessing. We are under attack. Is it? Is it though? Is it? Adela's microing so much stuff here. Inquisitor went down. Bane Wolf goes down. Everything just goes down. And next is the Sentinel. This is Adela's last match though. But yeah, he, I'm thinking he's out of this game. It's so unfortunate because he was just, he was looking so good in his first, second match. Yeah, GG. And that's the end of it.